Hello everyone, it's Jessica and today I'm going to share with you my new treadmill from WellFit. They did kindly send this over to me to share with you guys and I will have all of their information and the link to this treadmill down in the description box in case you want to check it out. So the shipping for this treadmill was really fast. It only took a couple of days to get to me. It pretty much comes fully assembled and here is everything that it does come with. It comes with a remote, an instruction manual, a safety clip, a phone holder, a power cord, some lubricating oils, and a few tools. And before you turn your treadmill on, you do want to add a few drops of the lubricating oil under the belt. So the only thing that I had to install was the phone holder that you see on the top bar. It was very easy to install. It only took two screws. So the on and off switch is located down on the bottom of the treadmill beside the power cord outlet. And speaking of the power cord, it is a little on the short side. So I did add an extension cord just to make it a little bit longer. So right now I'm just attaching the magnetic safety clip to my shirt. So if I pull on this or if I fall down or anything, it will automatically shut off. And you can also pair the treadmill to the WellFit health and fitness app using Bluetooth. There are a lot of different pre-programmed workouts that you can choose from, and it does track all of your progress, calories burned, distance, all that good information. And I was also really surprised that the app automatically played music as soon as I hit start. So right here at the top of the handbar are all of your controls. You can start, stop, and you can also adjust your speed up and down. So down here on the bottom of the treadmill is your display screen and it shows all of your information like speed, distance, time, and calories burned. So the maximum speed for this particular treadmill is 7.6 miles per hour and the weight limit is 265 pounds. So I'm definitely not a runner. I like to power walk and I like to do a speed of 3.4 to 3.6 with a maximum speed of about 4 to 4.2. And I was really impressed on how quiet the treadmill is when you're actually running on it. And here is a clip so you can hear what it sounds like. So another cool feature of this treadmill is you can also use it under a standing desk. All you have to do is fold down the arm bar like I'm showing you right here and then just scoot it up under your standing desk. And if you do decide to use it under a standing desk, it also comes with a remote so you have all of your controls right here. You can adjust your speed up and down. So I actually have a standing desk upstairs in my office and I might decide one day to put it up there, but for now I'm gonna keep it downstairs. And there are wheels on the bottom of the treadmill so it makes it really easy to move around your house. So if you are tight on space, you can easily store this under a couch or a bed and just pull it out when you need to use it. So I have this empty spot in between my living room and dining room and I thought it would be a perfect spot for the treadmill. It's pretty sleek and minimal so I don't feel like it's an eyesore sitting out in the middle of the room. So far I am really enjoying using this treadmill and my goal is to use it every day so hopefully I can stick to that. And the best part is it was even peanut approved. So I wanted to thank you guys for watching today's video. And if you have any questions about the treadmill, leave them down below. And don't forget to check out the WellFit website. I will have all of their links and information down in the description box. So definitely check them out if you're in the market for a treadmill like this. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you real soon with a new video.